Hi, my name is Ben Castillo. I'm one of the technical trainers here at SMA America Solar Academy. Today's tech tip is on the quick and easy way to install the Sunny Boy 240 microinverter and the Multigate XT. Here's exactly what we need from SMA for this installation. The Multigate XT, the Sunny Boy 240 microinverters, the DC connectors, the AC connectors, our end cap, and our optional AC field plug. I'm going to show you how to install the SMA microinverter system in three easy steps. First, we're going to install the microinverter and the cabling system. We've secured the microinverter to the racking and we've grounded it using the continuous grounding lug and the hardware that was provided in the box. You can also ground this using weebs per the National Electrical Code. After mounting and grounding the system, document exactly where the microinverters are at using the provided stickers. To begin your cabling, go ahead and start out with the DC connectors right to the inverters. Be sure and order the proper connector for the appropriate modules that you're using. To begin the AC connection, we're going to do a daisy chain configuration using a portrait cable or a landscape cable. Connecting inverter number one to number two. To finish the row, we'll put our end cap on the final inverter. After proper cable management, you can connect the DC connectors to the modules and secure them down to the racking. Now we can begin step two. We're going to hook up our PV system all the way down to our AC service via the Multigate XT. There are two methods of connecting the home run from the first inverter down to the Multigate XT. The first one is using a J box. For this method, we're going to use the AC cable from our first inverter, cut one end off, and then feed it right into our J box. From there, we're going to transition it using our SMA multi cable or your own wiring as the home run down to the Multigate XT. Our second method for completing the home run is by using the SMA AC field plug. Let me show you quickly how to assemble it. So the, here's our pieces that we're going to need to assemble our AC field plug. But first we're going to go ahead and put in our screw cap, our seal gasket, the housing, then we can make our connections, black, blue, ground conductor, which you can see here. The ground wire will go in the green colored terminal. Then we're going to go ahead and do you finally hear it click, seals gasket, screw it right on. With our home run created, Using our SMA AC field plug, we now can connect to our first microinverter. We can also use this AC field plug to go to remote inverters to go around chimneys or gables. At the other end of the home run, we have the Multigate XT. Here we have the Multigate XT1, which houses one Multigate US. We also have three other models, the Multigate XT2, 3, and 4. Let's go ahead and check inside. Here's a look inside a completed Multigate XT. Here's our home run from our PV array to our Multigate US, connected to line one, line two, and ground. Then we have our pre-wired from our grid to our circuit breaker from our Multigate US, and then out with our line one, line two, and ground to our AC service. Once you've made all your connections inside the Multigate XT, then you can move on to the final step. We showed you exactly where the AC connections for the Multigate US are. Now we're going to show you where you're going to connect the Ethernet cable to the Multigate US. Unlike traditional microinverter power line communications, SMA Solution provides a more reliable communication solution by sending the information through the Multigate US directly to the customer's router. A major benefit of using the Multigate US is that you don't have to add costly filters to your system. 
Just another reason why the Multigate US is a superior communication solution. With communications in place, we can return the cover plate and begin commissioning. Commissioning the system is extremely easy. Start at the AC service panel by turning on your 15 amp breaker, then returning to the Multigate and turning on this circuit breaker, and then confirm that you have green lights at your Multigate. Now you know your system is up and running. Another way to verify that your microinverters are producing is by connecting the Multigate directly to a laptop with Sunny Explorer. All you have left to do is register your system at sunnyportal.com for free module level monitoring for the installer and the homeowner. For more information, go to our website at sma-america.com. And if you want more training, click on our Solar Academy tab. My name is Ben Castillo. Thanks for logging in.